Let's blow out the candles. Dolly's becoming an adult. I'm so like, I feel like this has gone so fast. Happy birthday, Dot. Yes. Ah, and she teleports. Hey, besties. Welcome back to another part of the Nose Out Lazy Challenge. This is the third one of these I'm recording today. I am very much just loving playing this so much. So we are here with Dot and Hopscotch has just run away. I'm so upset. Today, the plan of action is it is Dot's birthday today. So she is going to be aged up into an adult, which is kind of freaking me out because let me just go through the rules with you guys of what the things we need to do is because I feel like we're running a bit late, you know? I feel like we're a bit behind schedule. So for this generation, we have to move at least three times in your life before settling down somewhere soon. So we only need to move one more time and then we get to settle down in San Marcino, which I'm really excited about because I've built the apartment already and I just really want to move into it. It's so cute. We need to master the politician career and complete the leader of the pack aspiration. We're kind of getting close with those two. So, well, we're like level five of the politician career, which I think will be fine. And with the leader of the pack aspiration, we're like halfway there nearly, I think. We need to master the charisma and writing skills. So this is kind of where I'm a little bit nervous about because I don't, we haven't been doing this one bit. Like we have, this is, we have, we've only just got on a computer. So we need to make sure to do this. Be at leader of the club and have a gather at least twice a week. We've already started doing that. Now, this is one that I've just forgotten about until just. Uh, complete the frog collection. Oh, I forgot that that was a thing. And we also have to have a minimum of three children. So, I feel like we're a little bit, I'm a little bit nervy because <laughs> because I feel like we have a lot to do and not enough time. But I forgot about the frog collection thing. I feel like that is something that we could do. I think Sims is going to crash, isn't it? It's going to do it, isn't it? It's going to crash. Sims is going to crash, isn't it? <laughs> it's going to crash. Please, BFF. <laughs> Please. And it crashed. Shocking. Absolutely shocking, that is. Also, can we all just discuss how absolutely terrifying this is? By the time that this is video is going up, this is probably going to be old news. But right now, uh... <laughs> I don't, I don't like this. Not one bit. Not one bit. <laughs> okay, we're back. Uh, <laughs> yay. At least, uh, wait, have I, what even, I don't even know what I missed now. Every, my whole, my brain's all confused. We need to secure another vote and also get to charisma level six. And like I said, I wanted to go ahead and work on her writing skill a little bit. Oh, she can't even, she's so tense. I'm going to get her to write a letter and see if that will make her less tense. Although to be fair, that doesn't, I feel like that would make her more tense. Actually, now I think about it. Yeah, I'm just going to get to play a bit Blake Block and Dead. Then we can write something. <laughs> Let's write a children's book because honestly, any extra income is grand. Oh my god, I forgot it's a birthday. Okay, <laughs> I just remembered it's a birthday. Sorry, the the it seems takes. No, you're not about to crash again. You just crashed again. Are you kidding? <laughs> What is happening today? Oh my god. I swear to god if this crashes one more flipping time, I am going to be very upset. I swear if this safe is somehow broken, that will be it for me. I will be crying. I'm just going to continuously save and hope that that fixes it. Don't you dare crash. Don't you dare crash. I'm not clicking anything. I don't even want to go to writing. I'm too scared. I'm too nervous. Okay, I'm going to try. Please work. <laughs> I am begging you. Okay, we've gone further. What should we call it? Um, the frog who lived. <laughs> the frog. I don't know why that was my first thought, but now it's the frog who lived. Awesome. Let's hope she actually likes writing. Otherwise, that'd be hashtag embarrassing. Why is it always literally the worst thing when you you do like a challenge like this? And you have to have your sim like specific things, and they're like, I actually hate writing. Uh, with every bone in my body, I think it's terrible in every single way, and I despise it. Like, why is that? <laughs> Why does that always seem to be the case? Okay, it is her birthday, so we do need to go at... <laughs> Hello? Why are you awkwardly standing outside my door? I do not know. Right, we need to go out. I think potentially a restaurant would be the best because we can bring a cake out then because we do not have the uh, money to do ourselves. Let's go here maybe, just somewhere simple. And I guess I don't even know who to bring. We can't bring no one. Maybe we'll just do a club gathering actually. Well, I'm a bit sad we have to bring Kay with us, but you know, it's fine. I'm still so upset about that. Yeah, you know, it's nice to go. Yeah, you're living the life. You got a pretty face. Okay, we are here. Let's go ahead and head inside. She's wearing a really cute outfit. Love that for you. Oh, damn. This guy's cute. I mean, not cute. I mean, I have guy, guy, sure. Uh, <laughs> I was gonna say, I have a, a girlfriend, but she's a sod anyways. Where should we sit? How many of it is there? Wait, is someone left? Or is it just the one that died? Wait, I swear someone's left. Wait, did someone else die? Surely not. Wasn't there someone else? I'm so confused. Oh, I have it so that only young adults can be in this club, and I bet Makoa aged up into an adult. Okay, that makes sense. Let's add someone else oh actually oh we're gonna get kicked out of our own club if i don't change that <laughs> i've just now realized let's change that to adult as well and invite the back in okay there's six of us so not not really where we can 
so which is fabulous uh <laughs> i love a good booth seat so maybe we go up here oh no wait is there any one chair okay we can go down here actually let's go ahead and request this table in the corner that is literally the table i would go for if i was in a restaurant so this is quite fitting why does she look so dressed up and no one else does ah! Good sir. I know you're in our club, but this is not a news club, for God's sakes. Okay, sit, sit down, bestie. Sit down. Okay, let's go. Oh, that's so cute. Okay, let's. I feel like we're just gonna have to bring out a cake, to be honest. I don't feel like we're gonna have time to do anything else. Let's get her a cheesecake. Oh my God, she's so into Kay. And they're opposite each other as well. Stop it. Stop it. Let's see if we can get Kay's vote whilst we're here. Okay, we managed to get a vote at least, but for some reason, we're not ordering for the table, which is not good. Bring out a cheesecake. Oh, for God's, is it because of the little thing in the middle? Oh my God. <laughs> this is just not good. Now, can you bring out a cake? <laughs> yes, okay. All right, let's add some candles. And let's... Let's blow out the candles. Dolly's becoming an adult. I'm so like, I feel like this has gone so fast. Happy birthday, Dot. Yes. Ah, and she teleports. Adulthood. Dot aged up. Fulfilling dreams. Planning for retirement and midlife crises. Away. The perfect time to start wrapping up those lifelong goals. Bestie, I have so many goals that are not wrapped up yet. Okay, well, we're now an adult. This is quite exciting. Let's all grab a, ser a serving together. And I feel like at this point, this is the point where we've got to be like, do you actually like us? Like, hey, I've just aged up into an adult. I imagine she's probably like, what, like 35, 40? Right, I just got interrupted, so I have no idea where I'm at right now. <laughs> what just happened? I don't know. Uh, yeah, that's what I was going to say, is that I feel like, you know, she's become a full-on adult. She's like, do you actually, like, find me attractive? Because you have given me very hot or cold signals here. So we're gonna ask about preferences if she says she's not into women that will be it We'll ask to just be friends and we could just be besties or something, but I don't know. I don't yeah well, She's like doing that and everything. I'm not into women. Yeah, okay. Well, I think it was a short-lived relationship uh, As was Elijah and her because you know, but we'll ask to just be friends I just don't think it's gonna work out. I mean the fact that she doesn't even like women is kind of a big big uh, a red flag You know, so I think she'll probably just be like you don't like me in that way and I think we're better off just being friends. I mean, they are still good friends. Like, they're like besties, so it's all right. I literally went from definitely wanting her to end up with Elijah to then definitely wanting her to end up with Kay to now her with no one and I literally have no thoughts of who she could, like, date. I feel like she needs to have a baby, like, ASAP. But the only thing I was actually thinking was what if she just adopted a child? She's meant to have a minimum of three children, but that doesn't mean that they have to be biological. So I was thinking maybe she could just be like, you know what, I'm sick of waiting around for a stupid person to have a baby with i'm just gonna go ahead and adopt a child for myself and then maybe she'll have a biological one like down the line instead because i do obviously want to keep like have the biological child be the next generation um but i think maybe that would be kind of a good idea so maybe like next episode we could adopt a baby probably not an actual baby maybe like a child i feel like she just i don't know i i get that vibe from her i don't know why like part of me thinks like would her and emery be a good fit in the end but like i think for the time being i'm kind of just gonna stop thinking about like the her like end relationship relationship and just say that she's just going to adopt a baby by herself and she's like happy with that you know i just realized that the other guy in the club is sat all the way up here <laughs> that's so sad oh my god bestie i just need to talk about clubs with you i'm so sorry <laughs> Why is that so sad? Because there's not enough seats, so he just sat upstairs. That is so... That's just terrible. Wait, haven't we spoke about clubs with five members now? I'm confused who we've got left. Woohoo in a bush? Oh my god, no. No. <laughs> no, not with Makoa. Not with Makoa. No, no. No, no. Not the married man. No, no. <laughs> okay, our milestone is complete for aspiration. I think this is the last one now, right? Yeah, this is the last one. So, we pretty much smashed this. We need to lead a club with eight sims, and we need to earn a thousand club points, which I think should be fine. Like, that's pretty easy. We need to go ahead and get the upgrade for more sims to be added. Let's add... Who should we add, actually? Maybe we should, like, try and find someone we haven't met before. Although, she's pretty much met everyone. I don't know. You know what? Rose is really nice. We'll, we'll add Rose. I'm pretty happy now that we've done that, like, part of the aspiration, because now we've only got, like, the last part, which should be easy enough. And then, other than that, all we need to do is level up our politician career a little bit more, and also work on charisma, which, honestly, I thought it was higher than that, but it's only at level 5, which isn't great. Oh my god, it's 2, it's 2 a.m. She has work in 6 hours. <gasps> no! <laughs> I do this every single time, I swear to God. Also, where's our house? Is it she just there? I don't know why I clicked that. Please do not take everyone with you. Thank you. Okay, we are back home. And oh my God, Hopscotch has returned. Yes. Hopscotch. 
Hopscotch. Get right here right now. Get here. Oh my god. This is a birthday miracle or I'm not. But oh my god, you're all stinky little s Oh, we don't have a bath. <laughs> we don't have a bath. Oh no. Yeah. Hopscotch is back. Oh my god, this is the best birthday gift. It was like on the same day. Well, okay, technically it's the next day, but sh all right, it's fine. We will need to get her a bath, but I'm thinking we'll be moving out soon anyways. Maybe when we adopt the child, question mark, then we can move out then. But I think now we basically just need to save up money. So we need to get out. Oh my god, I forgot that it's she, it's literally 4 a.m. But she's got work in a few hours. Oh no. I kind of want to like smash through the next few days this episode real quick and kind of just get through it so that we've got like a load of money. And then maybe on the weekend we can potentially adopt a child and move out I, I kind of do things at once i know she's so knackered still but we're gonna have to get her into work i'm so sorry babes we won't actually be able to get promoted today because we haven't got a christmas up but i think it should be fine anyways okay she's back home she is uh very tired very not happy i really want to go ahead and take hopscotch like to someone else's house so we can bath but also maybe i should just buy a bath that would probably be the better idea <laughs> i guess if i must you're not about to crash <laughs> you're not about to oh my god Oh, I've been through the bloody wars today with this. Oh, this one is so cute. Oh my god. Look at that. Oh, that is gorgeous. I've got to use that. I have to. I simply have to. Also, we've got a cake. Oh my god, I didn't realize I'd actually take it with us. Oh wait, we've got two? Bruh. <laughs> okay, well, that's cool. I guess if she ever wants to eat now, she can have that. Also, I might just go ahead and get rid of the shower now that we've got the bath. I'm probably gonna regret that, but I think that's the reason why she thinks everything's so stinky. I can't tell what else it would be, to be honest, but you know, I don't know. Let's give Hopscotch a quick bath and then we'll have to go to sleep already. <laughs> You've got to be kidding me! <gasps> oh my god! It crashed again. This is the third time. I don't know what is happening right now. I am so angry! <laughs> I just want to record a video. Oh my god. <gasps> We are back. Uh, <laughs> I don't know what is going on recently with my game and it's crashing. I am not very chuffed. Not going to lie. Not going to lie. But, um, you know, it's fine. Let's once again give Hopscotch a bath. Yay. The fact that those plantains are just sat there is just, it's... It's genuinely horrifying. Maybe that's what she finds so disgusting. Okay, she's giving Hopscotch a bath. Very cute times. This bath is literally so cool as well. <laughs> we do need to get a charisma up, so I'm thinking maybe we start a social media platform just to kind of, like, give us a way to get charisma up a little bit more, like, rather than just being with people. Okay. What are you about? Oh, my God. No. No, Kay. So this is gonna sound crazy, I know. We're friends and all, but well, here it goes. I have a crush on you. It's out there, so would you wanna go out with me sometime? You're super cool, I really wanna hang out with you more. We went, uh, we kissed. We made out at the romance festival, and then we found out you don't even like girls. No, let's just be, I'm gonna ghost her. I'm not, I don't know. No, no, I'm not having this. She deserves better than this. You deserve better than this, Dot, you do. It's 2 a.m. and she's wide awake. I may have made an error here. <laughs> My bad. Uh, it's fine. It's fine. And she's eating, she, uh, she's eating a baked potato that's been in there for days. Oh, God. Oh, my God. Sims is so laggy. But at the very least, we're going to get her to carry and write in her book, The Frog Who Lived. Uh, <laughs> don't ask me why I call it that. I do not know. She's feeling so, like, unfun. <laughs> if that makes sense. Wait, whoa. Oh, my God. All I did was do one thing, and that just made it go up so fast. Also, the lag is actually getting to me. Why is it like this? I don't know. Oh, wait. Now it's fixed. Okay. Oh, yeah. <laughs> As I'm trying to show you how laggy it is, of course, it's it fixes itself. It's a sod bag. So I'm gonna get her to create a social media profile and then we can start posting on there and hopefully getting our charisma up a little bit more. It's just kind of like an easier way of doing it versus like having to just keep going bright and day, compliment outfit, bright and day, compliment outfit. Although to be fair, I'm literally just doing the same thing here, except at least it's not to another sim. Okay, I'm gonna get her to go to work again. As I said, I just really want to like whack out the next couple days so we have all the weekend like in a, in a little bit. See, look how quick that is going up. You see that? Look at that. It's going up pretty speedily. So this is great. So we'll get some followers, which is good. And we'll also get like a load of charisma, which is also great. <gasps> no, 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 no. Yeah, skip work. Skip work. Quick. No. You're literally one thing away. There we go. Now you can go to work. I am not letting you not get promoted because of one flipping thing. Oh my God, it's Easter tomorrow. I feel like the, the things are happening so much. We don't have to join Pie House. <gasps> Marcus is an elder now. No, thank you. <laughs> we have our own club. The frogs are iconic. I'm actually going to go ahead and kick Kay out because I just, I don't know. 
I, they've just rubbed me the wrong way, you know? Um, and let's add someone else. Who should we add? Maybe Paolo would be a good one. <gasps> yes, she got promoted. Okay, she's been promoted to a council person. Let's go. We make 127 spoilers an hour. And we got two grand from that as well. <gasps> and the squared office. Is that an item? Can I sell that? <laughs> no, we've still got... Wait, what? The cheesecake. Stop. Oh my God. Awesome. So we now have like a load of money, which is grand. As I said, I think we'll do tomorrow's work. And then I want her to move out. I love this house, kind of. <laughs> but I, she needs to move one more time before we move into San Marcino. And I feel like we should do that soon. So yeah, I'm, I'm quite excited. I'm very excited, you know. <gasps> Look at the little outfit now. Oh my gosh, she's like a proper politician. She's already on level seven. Like that has gone up really fast. So I'm gonna start a club gathering because then we can get two things, like do multitasking. You know, we can secure some votes. But we can also earn more club points because we need to do both of those things. So let's just try and promote our policies to everyone. Technically, I think because they're all our friends, like I feel like they shouldn't be that difficult, I think. I think anyways, <laughs> from what I know, uh, I'm pretty sure it should be good. They keep just wanting to woohoo, honestly. <laughs> These people. Yes, okay, that's one more vote. Let's go. And we'll see Scat Charisma up, so I'm thinking we'll just keep <laughs> do the, the usual, constantly do the things. Emery looks sad. Bestie, what's happening? Are you okay, bud? Try for a baby, guys. <laughs> no. Uh not right right now. You know, not right now. Not really in the mood. Oh my god. Wait, what? Special gift for you, because you're such a great neighbor. Well, I know I am, but what gift? Honestly, these people just be taken out of the trash. Like, <laughs> it's great, really. Oh my god, what do you get us? That'd be something good a leaf oh the figure <laughs> the leaf figurine right should have phrased that a bit better you know okay we're getting kind of closer and closer to getting the thousand club points and do we have enough to get another member not not quite we need 500 we're at 429 we should be there soon hopefully honestly all we have to just do is like hug people and stuff and it just it just goes up it's wonderful it is all you have to do is be a nice person and we get loads of points <laughs> it's great it's, it's crazy maybe we could try like hooking some of these guys up with one another <laughs> Like, this guy, maybe we could be, or like, maybe Alex, we could be like, Alex. So, there's this guy, you know, the one in the club? Okay, never mind. Maybe Paolo? See if those two are- ah! Why does this man like me naked so much? Why does he choose to be naked all the time? Please, please stop. Great heavens. I don't know, Paolo, you're not very convincing. Oh my God, rude. He doesn't sound that interesting. Bestie. It's a catch. Stop it. It's like 11 p.m. Oh my God, it's like 11 p.m. I didn't realize. Okay, um, we can get the upgrade now, which is great. And we can add another member to the club, which is going to complete another thing. Let's add, who should we get? Oh, she's so cute. Let's add her. Okay, we've officially done that so now all we have to do is earn a thousand club points which we're so close to doing and we have officially finished our aspiration I feel like that's gone like so quick i feel like we've nailed that so i'm really happy about that because honestly i was kind of worried for a while oh my god why are you so stinky oh she's miserable all the time she really is also we did not do the tv se season premiere because uh, i don't know maybe the fact that we have like literally nobody well we do actually right now but you know what i mean and today is easter as well okay well <gasps> wait no, no 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 you're still going to work oh my god no 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 i'm not having a day off because it's easter absolutely not don't even know no no <laughs> we are going to work no matter what dar has the workers and businesses at their throat due to a world's a city wide strike i can't english very well folks need to get back to work but how does ha uh, how does she handle the situation stress compromise strong arm them maybe strong arm them oh <gasps> yes she got two new supporters let's go she's feeling so tense but it's now friday so after today oh makoa okay after today we have two days off which is exciting and i think we'll be moving out as well which i'm really excited about she had another grand as well this is good this is good i mean i don't know how great of a place we're gonna be able to get but even if it's like a little start home that's better than this you know <laughs> like maybe actually i'll look for some on the gallery you know that's probably the best thing for me to do okay when i had to look through and i think this one's my favorite so this one is by mandy k77 it's a tier one micro starter and it looks very much up her alley obviously it's so expensive so i don't know if we're gonna be able to afford it like even if we sold it this place we'd only be at like eleven thousand. so i'm thinking we get it unfurnished but that should be all right so i'm gonna go ahead and put all of the stuff that we want to keep in our household inventory and then we can move it all over afterwards even if it's unfurnished it should be fine i think that's everything god we do not have a lot of belongings do we oh wait the little frogs <gasps> could never forget you that's literally all our belongings ever <laughs> that 
is all we own. Wow. All right. Let's go ahead and move. Hopefully we can afford it. Um, I'm thinking, I don't actually know where we should live. Also, we're leaving behind the plantains. What a sad, sad day. Okay. So I'm kind of thinking Newcrest might be the move. Um, oh, wait. Okay. There is already plate things here, but we can just kick, like, we can just live there anyways. But I don't know. In my head, this kind of could make sense, maybe? I don't know. I don't, I mean, what would be the closest to San Mysuno? That That's kind of the real question. I feel like nowhere else is like San Mysuno. <laughs> like, maybe Evergreen Harbor, but I don't really like living there that much. I feel like Newcrest is our best bet because I barely live here and... I don't know. It'd be kind of fun. Let's live up here. We've obviously got to sell our furniture and bulldoze the lot. And we'll have 7k left. Hopefully that'll be enough for us to afford the unfurnished house. One can dream anyways. <laughs> Another thing we need to remember as well is the fact that obviously we're going to be adopting a child soon. So we need to make sure we have enough money to like, or like enough space to kind of fit a child in there. <laughs> okay, so obviously we don't have the money to actually get it furnished. But this should work, I think. <laughs> Please. Yes. Oh my God. Okay, I do not need a pool uh right away let's just delete that that is so much money that we do not need to spend it is unfurnished which is slightly unfortunate but it's hella cute and yeah i feel like this is a perfect place for her to live i want to change the outside to be green because you know right there we go that is hella cute like that and obviously the inside is a bit sad looking but we can, <laughs> we can change that we have a few items of things oh we have a bath though oh god also this is on a diagonal which is kind of weirded me out but you know <laughs> So it may not be the prettiest place in the world. I'm not a great furnisher, but this is just kind of what it looks like. I think it's pretty cute for what we have. I've kept like a load of money because I obviously want to adopt a child and obviously we need the space and we need like to find, figure out how to get a child, you know. But I think for, for you know, it's not the worst thing I've ever made. Uh, <laughs> but yeah, we've moved out now, which is so cool. I'm so glad we're finally in the home stretch and we can move to somewhere Shuno soon, which is really exciting. So that is where I'm gonna leave this video today, besties. In the next episode, I think we'll be in adopting a child. And yeah, I'm really excited. Remember to like, comment, subscribe to everyone. And I'll see you guys in another video. I love you guys. Goodbye. Stay alive, stay alive because I feel ready.